So, so what about the past booking behavior? You talked about a CRM well connected to a CRS. I mean, what is the difference between, you know, an OTA booker and a direct booker in this context? So every OTA, they have different ways that they, that they pass their data, right? They all start with their data being passed to the CRS. Um, and that's not true. Some, some have direct connects to, to their PMS as well, but the data that they are willing to share to whatever their connected system is, is defined by each OTA. So you get very little data, similar to like the GDS, you get very little data. However, in a situation where these people are booking um, and your CRS is deeply connected, your CRM has that information immediately, right? And it's immediately taking whatever data the OTA is willing to share and trying to connect that particular guest record with anybody that's existing that matches. So if that's true, let's say booking.com, they share a first name, a last name, and, an, and a phone number, for example, and maybe a state code, I think. That comes in, that's enough for me to identify you as the same customer that came in through booking.com is the same customer that stayed on property directly last year, where I have your communi a better communication method, I can put those two together. Now I know that you are the same person. You're both an OTA booker and an on-site booker. Um, and I can set up communication specifically to that OTA booker based on that OTA reservation, if, if you want, or in the future to try to get them to, again, we always want them to book direct. It's not always feasible, but you can offer um, specific different experiences if you, to get them to book direct by, by way of taking that information, communicating to them, getting them into your booking engine, modifying the booking experience and giving them discrete offers that only apply to them because you have them in your CRM. Um, and then they start booking direct. It, there's a potential there. But, but with a CRS connection, you really get that data in real time and you get to clean it. You don't have to wait for um, it to go through the path to get to the PMS, for it to get to assigned to a room, for it to get to your CRM and then have been modified maybe at the PMS level um, where there isn't really profile cleansing. 